Southern Smoke Boss said, this right here is the bomb. I'm offering his recommendation. Hey, but you know what? You can't go wrong with crab cakes and lobster meat. You can't go wrong. What you think, Camille? I'm ready to get in. <laughs> hey, so we finna get it in now. Welcome back to my channel, Smoking and Grilling with A.B. Today, on a recommendation from Southern Smoke Boss, I rode along with him to the Hampton Seafood Market and Restaurant where he told me it was going to be nothing but uh, seafood eye candy. And as you can see, they got everything. Everything from uh, crab claws. Uh, listen, they got bushels of crab, live crab. You name it, they got it. But I was here to pick up some lobster tail. And also, he told me they had great crab cakes. For the smoky flavor and the lobster tails, I chose to go with pecan chunks. Now here, I let, I did a uh, video in the past, which I put in the I card. It you know gives a detailed you know method on how to separate the uh, how to cut down the middle, open up the shell, and separate the uh, meat from the uh, membrane in the inside of there. What you're seeing here is I'm using two half sticks of uh, butter. Now I added minced garlic. Sprinkled a little J.O. You do this to taste. It's up to you about your seasoning. Some smoked paprika, some parsley, and then you just get it to uh, melt and then mix it. And this is what we're gonna put on top of the uh, lobster tail about every two to three minutes just to keep it nice and moist. All right, once you got your grill ready and it's up to temperature, you go ahead and place your lobster tails on top of the uh, grates. But listen, we're gonna use indirect heat. That means you're not gonna put them, as you can see the baskets with the charcoal in them right there, you don't wanna put them on top of that. That's called direct heat. We want to keep them in indirect heat. As you can see, they're away. Then we baste the top of the lobster tails with our garlic butter. And then I've added a little uh, a little seasoning to it. Just sprinkled a little, you know, smoked paprika 
and just some parsley you know mainly for the look because you get it from your garlic butter but i did that just for this video Now you want to keep your eye on your lobster tails to make sure that they don't dry out. I try to use this rule about every three, three minutes. I like to take a, you know, just a quick peek at them. And then I would like to just put a little bit more of my uh, garlic butter on there just to keep them nice and moist. So that when you know, you go ahead and cut them, you don't want, there's nothing worse than having dried lobster. Your lobster tail should be done in no more than seven to eight minutes. That should be the right texture and they should just melt in your mouth. Here I'm using Lodge's cast iron griddle grate. As you can see, it's a griddle on this side and a grate on the other. And I'm using this to uh, go ahead and make my the crab cakes. What I did here was I kept checking the bottom just to see how the crust was forming on, on the bottom of the cakes. And also you can see the doneness starting to rise up. As it gets about halfway and the uh, crust on the bottom is good, then I just flip them over. And then right here, you can see that they, you know, some of these were like in the grease because the grill wasn't completely level. So what I did was I just removed them, uh, you know, away from the grease, moved them away from the heat, you know, put it more so in the indirect heat and finished them up that way but I did keep my eye on making sure that it didn't burn. You guys just saw how I make, uh, got lobster, got that East Coast lobster. And then we got that lobster and uh, what is it? Lobster crab cake. Actually, it's just crab cakes with lobster, you know, meat inside of it. Hey, Southern Smoke Boss said this right here is the bomb. I'm offering his recommendation. Hey, but you know what? You can't go wrong with crab cakes and lobster meat. You can't go wrong. What you think, Camille? I'm ready to see it. <laughs> hey, so we finna get it in now. Huh? Look at my first mukbang. Mukbang. Oh. Mukbang. 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 <laughs> <laughs> one question when you're doing a mukbang i don't know how you talk because uh i'm i'm holding myself back i'm like beating this meat up pause, uh, pause. <laughs> <laughs> for those of you been watching the channel you know what i mean now i'm not a big lobster Got nothing to say but, but good about this. Southern Smoke Ball. Hey, listen, you can recommend anything to me. Bro, these crab cakes is cooked to perfection. Uh, they seasoned well. Everything about it. Colorful Camille, she over here playing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not an expert mukbanger. Big Snoop. I know. Snoop, you gotta show me how to mukbang. I hope this is uh, coming out right, bro. Too bad I don't have my mic, but I'd have my mic right here. So you, hey look, it's not so you can hear me cheer too, it's so I can hear myself too later on. Oh man. You ASMR? I'm starting to understand now, the ASMR. I'm thinking right now, I hope I got a thumbnail. Down with your cherry Pepsi. Woo. Look like I'm gonna have me a nice 
like a little snack tonight. This is what it's all about, folks. This right here is good time. Well, <laughs> with that being said, I'm gonna go down, go ahead and finish uh, eating this crab cake, and then we're getting ready to clean up, you know, our mess. Try to get out of here before this, uh, put these mosquitoes eat us up. Maybe they'll leave a little bit, you know, left with us. Oh, and if you're new to Smoking and Grilling's channel, I am his wife, Colorful Camille, and I have a channel of my own. So be sure you to check out my channel. I'm sure he'll give me an iCard somewhere <laughs> in this video. <laughs> so just click on the iCard and check out my channel. It's Colorful Camille. And I do beauty and makeup. And I guess mukbangs. <laughs> so. There you have it. She just plugged herself. So, <laughs> with that being said, you know what? Don't forget to like this video. Share this video. Again, like she said, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell to see more videos like this. And uh, outside of that, I'm out. Peace.